up in next to the Needle Museum. Next to the Needle Museum. Needle Museum? Yeah. Right. Welcome back to the channel guys. Right, welcome back. Right, so today what we're doing <laughs> is we are going to carry on with our Are They Haunted series. Now this is following on from that video that we did, Are Graveyards Haunted? This one is Are Abbeys Haunted? Or Abbey Ruins. Or Abbey Ruins, what's left of them, whatever, whatever we come across. We've never been here before. Uh, where is it? It's Bordesley Abbey. Bordesley Abbey. In Worcestershire. So, like I say, we've never been here before, so we don't know what to expect. But the little bit of research that we have done, there is apparently apparitions of monks being seen here, walking through, just like they would have done back in the day with the abbeys, walking through on their day-to-day -day basis. So, we're going to go and see if we can come across any of these monks. Or anything else. That's as long as they're not kung fu mugs. I don't fancy having a fight. What's a kung fu? I'll probably kung take two or three out, but the fourth one might get a lucky shot in, you know. Yeah. Let's go find out. Should we just go and find out? Let's look for the shadows. Shadows? It's supposed to be shadows. Shadow figures of people. But it's dark. With the lights, you'll see uh, shadows. Okay. Alright, we're, we're going to take the lights and use the lights. Right. Let's hope you enjoy the video. Moats. I mean, it's not a very impressive moat. I'm not <laughs> I, don't, lie. I don't think it's a moat, to be fair. It's more like a... It's a stream. You could jump that. Yeah. Well, no, no, not with this on my back. Oh, yeah, we got and I don't bit. fancy breaking another shoulder. We got I bet this gauge. is locked and all. Yeah, but the fence isn't exactly six foot. No, it, it's, no, it's not. It there says... a massive ditch there. Oh, wait, is, is it locked? Yeah. Are you sure? No. That's not locked. Just climb that. <laughs> we climbed that last one. Whoa, that bridge. Bridge was a bit dodgy. Eh? Right, yeah. Where is it then? Uh, That's just a lake. You're walking towards the river. Am I? Yeah, I can see it glistening. Is that thing we should stick on the path? No, there's a lake there. There's a lake there. There isn't a lake here, I'm walking. Oh. Come on. This is what people don't see. Oh, I don't think it's a good idea having the camera on my face with the light and it's pitch black and it's struggling to focus can you put the torch in front of me <laughs> <laughs> mate i can't see anything with that light it is good though isn't it <laughs> <laughs> whose idea was this yours Oh, I don't know. Oh, shoes. Need a gamer. Let's have a look. What have we got? Let's see. There we go, people. Well, someone walks this way. Maybe it's the monks. Better see a monk after this. A monk or a sunk. I think you can. It's beyond. It's beyond this fence, mate. Better say. Yeah, but how do we? Ah. 
why don't we walk around? It's lucky you didn't put on your expensive trainers, I eat. No point going for the guide. Uh, right. Here we are then. We're circumnavigating the Abbey. Circumnavigating. We are, it's, it's here. Whose idea was this? Yours. I'm taking no responsibility for this. This is the one expedition to let you see everything on. And we're in the middle of a field. Getting absolutely soaked. Do you know what? Never again. Next time I'm planning. You can just step over the fence. Into what? Into some holes. I'm sure we've missed her. Yeah. Spider there. Who's too all brave in that now? Do we risk climbing that or do we find a way in? Okay. We must have completely walked past the way into it. Yeah, it's probably, we've probably come all that way. Oh. Leave it to me, is it? Oh, it. <laughs> That's a metal fence there, Jack. There's a metal fence there, That's mate. A big metal fence. Yeah. Well, uh, lump so, it. How do we get in? Just climb over. It doesn't say no trespassing, so... Huh? It's only a small fence. Yeah, it's only a small What's the worst that could happen? There could be a moat. Come in. Please back first. Landmine. The, ba the bag stayed. to be a rabbit hole or something like that. I found out it was mate. Right. So we're in. There we go. So let's take you down. <laughs> Me toes are wet. Touch dive. My torch Looks like you're sitting in the dark then. My torch. My torch works. This is the vestry. So the light's not blocking the words. So 
Always a good sign. Help, please. There's the stairs. I don't know what the symbols are on the stones. Maybe this is like an altar. I haven't heard any monks yet. Stones have all got strange symbols on them. I can't remember the actual dates of this, but we'll put it all up in the links. Put it in the description and put a description of what this place actually is and what it was. There we go. There's your graves. Uh, up tombs. Some more of these strange stones. Symbols on I can't quite see the symbol. Stone tombs. I think maybe it'd be worth putting a REM pod in both of those. The good news is, I found Mike's stuff, but I haven't found Mike. So hope he hasn't fallen down a hole. He's throwing stones at me, child. I can see you there, mate. I don't know how you think you're gonna scare someone that's come on a paranormal investigation. You are. I don't know how you think you're going to scare me when I've come to be scared. Oh, there's, there's two graves in the floor there. I reckon put a REM pod. Huh? Yeah. Hold on, I'm just going to come out the door. Oh, there's no way out. There's no way out. Oh no. Oh, is that like a little pillar? I'm going to set some stuff out all over the place. You carry on doing your explore bit, mate. I've done it, mate. I've done it. Done, yeah? There's not much to explore. We need a ruins. Careful of that. Yeah, I want to put a REM pod in each of them, mate, or a... What is it? They're graves. Is it really? Yeah. It's where the monks are buried, you know, in churches and stuff? Yeah. If you go to church, if you look on the floor, there's this lot of tombstones. You feel me, Tap, yeah? I don't know. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's good. That's good. See, there's tombs, there's like tombs, there's like... Well, this would have been, I presume, the altar. What, this bit here, though, is not it? So what would that be in there? I don't know. These it's got a V on it. No, that's got a, like a symbol on it. And there's a couple all knocked around with symbols on I don't know whether they're original. So... 
And then there's the vestry over there. Uh, I reckon put a REM pod or something in each of those. Or a, mu or a music box face it towards. Yeah, the music box I'll face it well away from us. Because. I'll probably put the music box on that little stand there, face it in there. Yeah. And then I'll put the rest of the REM pods in the face. I don't feel. No, but we haven't asked for anything to come forward yet, have we? No, no. The feeling might change. I don't feel scared. To the point I was wandering around in the dark on my own. It's not very often I do that, by the way, guys. No. If I walk off in the dark on my own, it's because I feel easy. And then you check your pockets. So what we've got on the floor is we've got two... Um, Graves, tombs, I don't know what you'd call them. Um, I think you normally find them in some of the older churches. This dates back, I'll tell you the actual date, it's easier. So it was a 12th century Sister Sister Cian or Sister Cian Abbey. And one of the tombs belongs to uh, Guy de Beauchamp. That's the 10th Earl of Warwick. He was buried here. I think it was King Henry the Second. Um, I think he had a lot to do with this, this abbey. I think he um, abolished them being paying taxes on things they sold and bought. Um, he allowed them to knock down surrounding buildings to create areas for them to, to grow, to, to breed cattle, to raise cattle. Um, I think they were actually free of prosecution. There was, I can't remember the, the date, this is what I've read and what I've heard, but there was a, one of the monks um, was being investigated by the Bishop of Worcester, or the Cardinal of Worcester. Um, it had something to do with a local girl or a local woman. Um, it sounds like, reading the information, it sounds like it was some sort of sexual assault, uh, but there's no record of what happened afterwards. So again, it's uh, Bordesley Abbey, so if you Google it, you get your information there. Mike's just setting up a few devices now. It's probably the best way for them to communicate. So there's Sid. Sid's now got his own grave. Is it a grave or is it a sarcophagus? Or is it a tomb? But it looks like this was a fairly, I don't want to say tall guy, I wouldn't fit in there, it's like my bath. But if you can imagine this is where they obviously laid, it was either that one or that one, Guy de Beauchamp. Like I say, it was the 10th Earl of Warwick. Pills out. Pills off. Pills talking. Like I say, there's Sid. What we're looking for, guys, is shadows, monks. Is Bill picking my shadow up here? Yes. Yeah, the torch. Look, the torch lights by him. Um. Yeah, because your shadow's over there, look. Yeah, no, okay, there's some more strange stones. That's me. So there's, there's Bill. It's on the wall. But this would have been a passage way, wouldn't it? Like a doorway? Uh, it's hard to tell, mate. There's it a, there's looks a, like a doorway. Let's go back to the map. So, if I... What's here? Oh, so... There's a Star of David on this one. Jace. That says there... The hospitium and the kitchen. So it was the doorway? It says hospitium, so I'm presuming that's like the medical bay. Abbot's lodgings is to your right. Okay, so where would the monks have slept? In the lodgings? So the north aisle 
of the south aisle. The choir was to the right. There was an infirmary. Oops, sorry, I'm reading it and not putting the camera on it. So what was the infirmary? It says you are here. So hang on. It says you are here. So it's more this way. So we're there. Yeah. So that's an aisle. The centre bit is the cloister. Because we want to do this as, as logic as we possibly can, don't we? Fourth aisle. That. Well, I'll put Bill. So we're here. Bill's sat here somewhere. Yeah, yeah, going off. That's it. Obviously the choir was down the front. I'm presuming this is where the monks sat. Yeah. Ambulatory hospitium. Sort of an old infirmary. Are you not bothered that Bill's going off quite a lot? I am. He's, there's nothing there. What well, Sid isn't. I suppose. Well, now there's light there. There's no no, no motion. Strange. I'm no archaeologist. <laughs> look like at dinosaurs. That does look like a Star of David, though, doesn't it? it? Does look like a Star of David, yeah. <laughs> the symbols must have meaning. His back's facing us, so he's not picking us up. No. And it's every time the light's off. So. Maybe set the night vision camera up. That was the rampart and the, and the motion sensor. Because his headlights up for the rampart, his belly lights up for the, for the motion. Well, it's busy tonight, isn't it? Yeah. Maybe. Maybe there's a shadow. Maybe the monks are here. Monks, are you here? <laughs> Guy de Beauchamp, are you here? Who's that then? The 10th Earl of Warwick. Is it there? Yep, this is one, one of these two were his. Is it? Yeah. I think Sid's in the wrong one. So <laughs> Sid's going the wrong way. What's all the metal around it though? I presume it had like a mesh fence on it at one point when they discovered it. Because this is still an active archaeological site. Still a what? Still an active archaeological site. So the University of Reading are still doing digs. Bill's really busy tonight. I really think you should get the night vision out, mate. I'm gonna. I'm just setting up some stuff. Because it's so dark. We could be missing loads of things. Did you hear that then? Going some tonight, isn't it? Let me go around the corner and see if I can catch anything on camera. Get that door for yourself. I heard like the stones. I heard the stones going then. Like someone was walking across them. Thank you. There's someone walking around down here. Let's just see if it's like a creature. It's like a 
can actually hear something walking on these stones but I can't see any sort of wild animal it's about time Music box is going. Yeah, I'll turn it on. Here we are. Huh? Everywhere we go, look. We got a Cyril. Is it? Yeah. Where? Hello, Cyril. Where's he gone? Here, in the wall. I can't see him. Look. Hiding in the wall. I don't know if it was him, but I heard like footsteps over the other side. That gap in the wall there. Oh, there he is. Yeah, look. Hello, Cyril. Like a field mouse. He's not actually that scared of us, is he? Wait, well, is there. In there. I don't know. The reason why I was looking and I spotted him is because I heard footsteps. Would you hear tiny little footsteps? Like no, that? no. I heard footsteps on these stones at the same time Bill was going. Bill hasn't shut up, has he? That's Bill again, isn't it? Yeah. Mate, is there something here? You reckon? Yeah. Mate, on a little bit of evidence so far, I reckon abbeys are a bit more haunted than graveyards. Yeah. It's like they said in the comments and what people have said to us. Losing Here's boxes off again. Ooh, I'll get the balance. Um, like everyone said, the graveyards are just where the bodies are. Yeah. Soul has left the body. There must be this place must be full of memories though. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. So Sid never does anything. And tonight he's decided to have a little sing song. And he sat in. That guy there. He very rarely does anything. He's probably the most, the least sensitive REM pod we've ever had. Don't know whether that's a good or a bad thing. So, and then the music box is facing nothing. So there's nothing here. So there's no mice, nothing crossing the front of it. It's just pointing towards here. Ah, Cyril's here now. Cyril's here now, and there's another. I think this is where that guy was buried. Is huh? Concrete box there? Yeah. So this is, uh, this must be where that guy, the Pojap, was buried. So I think, maybe, we need to put Sid in there. Right here. Yeah. I think maybe we should put Sid in here. These must have been just for monks. These ones on the floor must have been just for monks. Come on, Sid. It's not a good piping up there, mate. This is Sid, everyone. He's our lazy rem pod. He's going to go in here. I think he's going to stand where Mr. Bochamp's head would have been. Should have bought some gloves. A bit gold. Right, I've put two lights around, Bill. Motion lights. Yeah. Rem 
put on there. focus. I'm seeing there's walking over here. But for some reason the focus is way off on this. Put in a cap ball in the middle of this star David. set up on these uh, these marked stones on the EMF K2 over there Sid's in the sarcophagus up there Bill's here Got another music box no REM pod sorry over there and the music box facing up here are there any spirits here? Put in the comments. Death is not the end. Death is not the end. Thank you for that information. Do we have any names? Is there anyone here with us? The spirit talkers now on. Death is not the end, is what we just had. Spirits, monks. That all on the Star David. Okay. Not the wind? No, I wouldn't have thought so. It's not really going off at the minute, the wind, is it? Mm. And Bill's gone quiet. Anomaly. Oh, anomaly. Where? Where's the anomaly? Is there anyone here with us this evening? That ball again, mate. Is there anyone? I'll do it this way. Spirits, monks, or the Earl. If anyone's here this evening, please talk to me through this device. The spirit talker, which is the box over on the wall there. Or maybe make one of the other devices go up. Peace, we mean you no harm. We're here to find out who you are, if you've crossed over, or if you haven't. Is there anyone here? 
please talk through this device. My name's Jason. Give me your name. And the chav over there is Mike. Please feel free to use this device. Okay, nothing on that, people. It's probably too breezy, I think, for that. Just a little bit. And there's a lot of background noise. So there's... So there's a lot of background noise from the road. He's on the Star of David. Mm -hmm. We make the noises. Yeah, we make the noises. Let me turn the camera around, sorry people. Oh. So what have we had? We've had We Make the Noises, Brown, Yes I Will, Can You Feel Us, Gravestone, Skellington, Anomaly, Death is not the end. Music box. <clears throat> I know his bill's gone quiet. There's one of them stones there, isn't there? Is that, no, that's grass, isn't it? Okay. Poltergeist. Poltergeist. Yes, please. Show yourself. Mm hmm. Like on the stones? Yeah. You can hear walking guys on the stones. It's gravel floor as you can see. We're both walking next to each other and we both stopped at the same time and we can still hear walking. Dude. Dude. It's a modern spirit. Oh, these stairs here. My body was taken. Is <gasps> it? That would make sense because they're empty. Hmm? Something's happened to the bodies. Why do those stairs lead, Spirit? Mikey stood still. And he stood still as I'm walking. I get a sense of someone's walking with me. So I'll put the camera this way. I can't see where I'm going, but. Maybe, I'm going a bit back with this one. maybe you can see if there's anything behind me. Let's just turn 
actually somewhere so I can see myself. It's not vain, it's just I need to know. So I'm walking into the darkness. Oop, I tripped over my first stone. Footsteps. Yeah, I just heard it as well. It's like when I walk. Well, I'm on camera as being stood still at the same time. Again? It's like I'm being followed. Spirits, are you following us around? Are you interested in what we're doing? You must see a lot of people walking around in here. Do you like to follow people? Over there. I told you, didn't I? That's Sid. That was Sid? Yeah. Sid's just gonna... I think we're well weird because we don't know for our devices, but his name is Sid. Yeah, that's alright. And he's in that sarcophagus over there in the distance. You can learn your equipment. The one that's normally the most noisy is my one. Me, you Can were you putting Solomon on. Are you, you going to do a kneel and take ten minutes to set it up, or are you gonna, is it going to be virtually instant? I've got it ready when you are. Okay, right, guys, this is your Solomon warning. We're going to play Solomon. If you don't like this prayer, skip this part of the video or put it on mute. And we're going in three, two, one. Solomon's finished. You can Thumbs unmute up. him. What about SNS? What about your SNS? Mm -hmm. uh, I have got SNS, but you need to really light the place up for it to work. Mm. It doesn't pick up on low light. Why is it so cold? It wasn't this cold originally. Hmm? So you take that camera and go and sit on the wall as far, you, as far as you can that way. <laughs> as far as you can that way, yeah? Yeah. I will take this camera and I'll go over there and sit on the wall. Yeah. And we'll both just do five minutes in the dark alone. Alright? I'll have a lot of fun with this. Yeah, well, yeah, you know what I mean though. 
Okay. With the different cameras and so then... So I'm going into the corner by Bill. You're going into the, the most active Bill. part, yeah? Huh? The most active part, where Bill is. We've had footsteps in there. Well, do you want me to call that in? Nah, no, I'm not scared, mate. Right, so if you hear anything, shout to me, all right? And I'll be on the camera of what I'm doing this end. Does shouting include screaming? Yeah. Okay, just check, just check it. Just check so you can scream, you can shout. Oh, cat ball. Just as I'm going down here as well. Great. Right. Star of David one. Huh? Star of David one. No, the one on the left. No. Yeah. Looks like a nice chair for me there. Right there. So I'm going to sit here. A torch. Is that a torch in your pocket or are you just pleased to see me? Oh, there we go. So now I'm sat just at the beginning of the abbey where we walk in. Um, I can hear footsteps, but I think that's Mike. I can hear him talking as well. I can't actually see anything because I've got the light in my face. I'm just trying to listen for noise, but there's a bit of a breeze. Are there any monks here with me this evening? I don't mind if you whisper in my ear, tap me on the shoulder, push me off the rock, or set the REM pod off. Well, oh, my battery's dying. One second, people. Oh, sorry about that, guys. So the battery died um, just at the most pivotal moment. The REM pod to my right was going off, and the cat balls got off. We'll just say it didn't happen because you missed it. What's that spark? Almost like someone's walking around the outskirts of the abbey. I'm not sure if it's the wind moving, <coughs> maybe plastic or something on the gravel. It'd be a bit of a coincidence. Maybe I'll take you over and have a look. It's the only way we're going to find it. Let's go and see. It's just in my corner, the mic's on the other side, so. But again, this is where I heard the footsteps earlier. There's a bit of plastic rubbish down there. What was that? Music box is going in the distance, I can hear it. I heard like a chain. Bill. Motion. Motion. Okay, good. They're working. I heard like a chain or something. Maybe maybe we'll review we'll review. Review the footage. Jace. Yeah. I've just had interaction on command mate. What happened? Just to confirm, I can see Jace, but he is probably 115, nearly 200 yards away. No, no, probably not that. He's probably a good 100 yards away, though. He is. He won't be able to hear me because I can't hear him. 
So we're gonna do five minutes sitting alone in these little bits and see if we can uh, see if we can see anything or feel anything, hear anything. So on that, spirits, if you are here, please come forward. Please come forward and throw something. Make a noise, a bang. Talk to me. Calling out to the spirits of this abbey. Come and make yourself known. We really would love for you to come forward and... Right now, bye. just seen some somebody standing there in that corner I thought it was my eyes playing tricks on me and then I saw it again and I just saw the outline of somebody standing there spirit if that was you can you come back and stand there again please do it for the camera Come and show yourself in that corner. Did I just witness a monk? Come and do that again for me. Come and stand there. joking me. Music box pointing in this general direction. And I think he's getting action up there. Spirits, come and walk back in front of that music box for me, please. <gasps> On command. Jace, I've just had interaction on command, mate. Hold on. I'm going to, uh... I'm coming to meet back up with you. Hang on. Oh. Jace. Yeah. Jace. What? Bring that camera here. Was it me, people? Did Mike sound nervous then? Bring that camera here. That was screwed on and it just went and it just flew off the stand. I've left it exactly as it was. Well, everything broke. I know, I, I do as well, but it was screwed. Well, that will be on video anyway, It was screwed it? on there. It's alright. It's recording still. 
it's upside down. So that'll be on video? That'll be on video, yeah. That and you'll happened. be nowhere near it. What was it? Oh, it was just like somebody standing there. I just caught, I caught it out of the corner of my eye. I looked and I could just make out a shade. In this corner? In that corner, it's just standing right there. And then that started happening. So I've run round and as I've gone, can you walk in front of that again? It played again. And then as I asked you to come over, Sid started going up. So it was almost like something went from here to here to there and then over towards Sid. Mm -hmm. Well, just for the record, I had nothing down there. Did you not? No, I just felt like someone was walking with me. But I said it could have been the breeze blowing a bit of plastic across the stones, I don't know. It felt uneasy over here. Like, to the point where I thought, I've got to get you over here. Mm. It's going to move just in case that's me setting that off with the load. I'm not saying it is, but... This camera has never, ever, ever come off this stand before. Never had a camera. I thought before. it was virtually impossible. Look, you try and get that off there. It, it feels virtually impossible to do. recording mode on this. I'm gonna set this up behind that music box. Would you like to like me to give you a countdown? Should we say three, two, one? Hands are shaking. Oh. You get cold so easy. It's got really cold. It's a bit choppy. Cold. That works. <laughs> a bit late now. Creek? There's nothing to creek. That's a floorboard. Oh, yeah. Do you reckon floorboards are a bit above us? Nah, they wouldn't. It would have been rock. What? Oh, it's the ceiling. Yeah. Would it? Yeah. Would it have been concrete, well, stone? There wouldn't have been timber. There might have been timber beams, yeah, but they're, they're long rotten, aren't they? Yeah, but what I mean, would there have been timber as a floor above us? It's not focusing. No, it is. Spirit, come back in front of that machine for us. Please. Okay. It just all seems to on command, doesn't it? Are you set Sid off? Be very impressed if you could make Sid move, Sid talk. Sid is the device in that box. It doesn't usually talk. Whether it's the field mouse or mice, because there was two, wasn't it? Or whether the monks are here. This means a cat ball behind you, mate. So, anyway, I think what this means for us now is 
we need to start doing abbeys and cathedral, like cathedral ruins because there might just be something there so okay. graveyards are a no so graveyards are a no 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 so if we're going with the theme of the are they haunted series mm. what are we saying about abbeys potentially potentially do you think some of this could be explained away it's not them footsteps again do you think a lot of this do you know the equipment going off tonight do you reckon some of that could be explained away when there was a big gust then i think that's why sid was going off so you think we can set off red pots? Just, well, I don't know. I, don't, I, I ain't got a clue. I, don't I really just, don't know. It was, it was a coincidence that the wind was going, and then Sid was going like mad. Okay. That's not how wind goes, by the way. That's more like a horse, isn't it? <laughs> horse or wind? <laughs> or horse with wind? I mean, the EVPs weren't really clear enough because of the breeze again. Yeah. Um, the cat balls, I mean, the breeze isn't catching the cat balls, so that's one I can't get. Bill has gone quiet. Yeah, do you reckon the reason that him that one off then? What, the wind? Yeah. No. Do you reckon it knocked it off the stone? No. It's not strong enough. The wind is not strong enough. I think... Done it off camera though. That's the problem. Yeah, we'll no it camera it caught it. We'll get it under the talk. My eyes are playing tricks on me now as well, so I'm seeing shadows. I'm not seeing these shadows, I'm just seeing shadows. I think it's because every time you put the light on, you know. I definitely saw something in that room down there. 100% I saw something. I can't prove it, mm. but I I definitely saw something. Give it a permission. I 100% saw something in that room down there. Am I hearing noises again, man? What you're going to have as well is you're going to have that whatever happened to the uh, night vision camera on camera. Yeah, that was such a horrible and I felt weird mm. when it was all happening. I think this is the sort of place where you need a lot of call outs. Yeah. Maybe a few more people. Do you know what this is the sort of place we need? Neil. Yeah, yeah Neil. Fancy, this uh, is the sort of place we 100% need Neil. Yeah. Because he doesn't stop calling out. We get distracted with stuff. We know we do. Yeah. We're good at other stuff. Neil, he's, well, he's, one of his main features is he constantly calls out. And that's what we needed tonight. Okay, two was going up behind so, the cat ball behind you again. It's the only one that's been going off, man. And if you look, he's literally sitting on the Star of David. I mean, I'm not saying that's paranormal. I'm just saying it's weird. It is just weird because this one that's been sitting on this symbol, whatever the symbol is, hasn't gone off once tonight. There's a cat ball on here. That hasn't gone off once tonight. They're working. They just haven't gone off. Whereas this one has gone off nearly all night long. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, I won't. <laughs> the cat balls just told you it won't go off anymore. <laughs> <laughs> what was that? I don't know. I think the camera just spoke. Can the camera talk? Uh, uh, it's got Bluetooth on it. Where's your phone? My pocket. I hope it's your phone. Maybe. Right, come on, let's call this. You're dithering too much, man. I'm getting forward to watching. Well, it's because I'll start with I was walking around holding the camera. Got any can hold now. Great. Got it? Yeah. Right, guys, we're going to call that a night for that one. Uh, it's getting a bit chilly. Just a bit. Jace feels the cold more than normal people. I do. I do. I'm used um, to the heat. No power pack in it. <laughs> Use it for the camera. <laughs> what the fuck was that?
Mm, could be people. Huh? Oh, just Joyce, it was directly behind us, right? Yeah. It was like a. <laughs> Did you hear it? Yeah. That'll be on camera. Well, we both shot around at the same time. We were talking to the camera and we both shot around. Typical, just as we're about to call it. Yeah. Well, we are, we're still calling it. We're going to come back in the summer. Mm. When it's a bit, well, in a couple of weeks, when the weather picks up a little bit, we'll bring Neil back. Mm. I think that's what we're missing tonight, that, just that little bit of a spark with Neil. I think what we're going to do is we're going to do a few more of these types of ruins as yeah, well. Yeah, absolutely. During the summer, we're going to do a load of Abbey series. We'll do some more Outdoor. graveyards. Outdoor. We need to go to Pendle, Pendle Hill. It's not a ruin though, is it? No, we need to go there. We are going to go there. So. No. We're packing up, aren't we? Yeah, we're packing up. Yeah. Right, guys, so if you did enjoy the video and you're new to the channel, please do consider subscribing. I've been looking at the analytics and noticed there was 91% of the watch time for one of the videos come from non-subscribers. So please just do us a favour and just hit that subscribe button. It don't cost you anything and it really does help the channel. Um, don't forget the bell. Yeah, put the notification bell on. Give us a thumbs up. Give us a thumbs up on the videos and drop a comment in below. Any suggestions? I always say on every video, any suggestions of where you think we should go? Any ideas? Any recommendations? Um, any mediums out there that fancy a night out? Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Got to test everything. Yeah. Got to test every theory, I'm open, mate. I'm open to everything, mate. Yeah. I'm, open to it. I'm very sceptical of mediums. But listen, I'm listen. open to it all. I'm the sceptic. No, You're I'm, the I'm very sceptical of mediums. Okay. But if one wants to come and prove me wrong... Come on, tell me about you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so... <laughs> yeah, right, we're going to call that one. Oh, yeah, let's call it. Right. Right, thanks for watching. We'll see you soon. Tati bye.